so just to provide more uh, background on that, obviously he ended the year um, uh, with an injury. Um, and then the, the way that we had handled it uh, in collaboration with Jake and the medical team was to continue to monitor it. Obviously, he continue to skate and train on it. But from, from our view, uh, I'm thinking with Jake and the team's best interest, we didn't want it to linger into the year. And so when it wasn't healing the way that it was supposed to, uh, Dr. Vias and Chris Stewart in collaboration with, with Jake and, and the people on the ground in Minnesota, was given a very specific methodology to go through it, including trying it in some game action uh, in the league there that, uh, that Ben Hankinson runs, uh, the Beauty League. And um, it just wasn't uh, comfortable enough for him as he was getting up to the prescribed levels. Um, so at that point, uh, it was decided that, uh, that we would have the uh, surgical um, uh, solution performed. And um, that'll get Jake back up to 100%. It's in Jake's best interest, and it's best for the team to have Jake at 100%. So uh, we'll miss him um, for the first couple games of the year, but then he'll be uh, back to the Jake we know, which I think is the best solution for all of us.